Okay, so when you open up the simulation or the online lab, it should look something like this. Um, you've got a couple of buttons here. So um, you've got run, which is basically play. And you've got the food web here. You've got plants, herbivores um, that eat the plants, omnivores that eat plants and the herbivores, and finally your tap predators, which are straight carnivores or meat eaters. Your first direction is to turn plant A and plant B on. So <clears throat> this might look different for you. If you turn everything on, it's like the full food web. I want you to make sure you have everything turned off because right now we're gonna look at how two plants compete. So I'm only gonna turn on plant A and plant B. I'm gonna hit run. Now I'm hitting pause. But you're going to run until this is day 15, excuse me, day 100. When you're done, you've got this graph right here. And uh, to get the, the population size, you just simply have to click, uh, put your cursor, not even click, put your cursor on the graph. So it looks like plant B and plant a, does that work? Uh, both started with about the same number of plants, 5,000. Um, those are the numbers that you will put in your data table. And then over here is day 100, and you'll have a graph over here. You can just put your cursor on it again, and it'll give you the exact value for that day.